Aloha everyone and welcome to this wonderful venue here in Napa. Both Jody and Dan are incredibly thankful for your presence here on this gorgeous California day. Today as we sit here as family and friends to witness this beautiful union, we cannot forget those late loved ones who reside here in spirit. In particular, we know that Dan's mother, Tu Cook Hun, and Jody's grandfather, Akiyano, are smiling and here with them on this special day. I would like to welcome all of you tonight. The coming just helps Jody and Dan celebrate their wedding. I know that you have come from near and far to be a part of this day. I thank you. Today is one of the proudest days of my life. <laughs> An absolutely wonderful day. But as much as I would like to take credit for the beautiful woman that Jody has become, nothing is more practical than falling in love in a quite absolute and final way. What you are in love with, what seizes your imagination, will affect everything. It will decide what gets you out of bed in the mornings, what you will do with your evenings, how you spend your weekends, what you read, who you know, what breaks your heart, and what amazes you with joy and gratitude. Dan, you are my inspiration. You are my companion in all things, and we've been through so much. You know me better than anyone, and somehow you still manage to love me. You have helped me become a better me, and I am so excited to grow with you. Jody, I love that you are my rock. I love that you're always my biggest cheerleader. I love that I can celebrate my successes and achievements, but also know I have your support in disappointments and failures. As we leave here today, may you too, as well as everyone else here, remember, just like everything else, love takes time, love takes work, and most of all, love takes two. Dan and I have been friends for over 20 years, and during that time, we've participated in a lot of events and activities as a team. We've been partners, you know, in the introductions earlier today, they let you know that we were doubles partners uh, in high school on the tennis team. Inside our hearts are racing. And um, we've been roommates uh, in our annual vacation to Las Vegas. A uh, group of us goes to Las Vegas once a year, and this is about year 12 uh, running, consecutive trip there and Dan and I have been roommates for the past 10 years so that's been uh, you know an enjoyable time to be able to spend some quality time with Dan as a group and in a one-on-one -on -one scenario no matter what life brings if it's you and me so from the very beginning Jody has been caring to a fault about the comforts and the needs of others. Even this wedding is a testament to that, making sure we're all equipped with comfy shoes and enough Kleenex to go around. She's always been a loyal friend and sister, and I may not always have appreciated your attempts to guide me in your infinite big sister wisdom, but no matter what, You've always showed up for me. Somehow, if it takes forever, we'll get there together. I'm winding along this road, not knowing where you will go, no matter what life brings. Ready for anything Watching the clouds 
good number of years ago, I became a father for the first time. And while leaving the hospital that evening, I felt very different. I suppose not unlike many first-time fathers. I was a daddy. There's someone running round in your head tonight Circling your heart like a satellite, I know There's ghosts in the road in my home, that's right Where creeks and the floors and the water pipes run. In the days following, I remember shopping at the baby store And before I knew it, I had about 20 little frilly pretty dresses over my arms and I was just going and going and somehow that between that moment and the cash register I thought she's gonna outgrow these in a couple of months I came to my senses it's dust falling down from the sea Tracks of the past life steps and plans I'd follow. When I began college in San Francisco, Jody had also recently moved to the Bay Area. So it was a great comfort and convenience <laughs> to have her close by. <laughs> when I needed a break, I could always catch Caltrain down and spend a weekend with her. Although for some inexplicable reason, my visits always seem to coincide with Jody running out of milk. On a cloudy day. During the subsequent years, Dan came to visit us for holidays and for wedding venue shopping. I just wanted to let you guys know that we could have all been in Hawaii this week celebrating, but Dan wanted to be over here. Each time I've had the privilege to spend time with Dan, I've liked him more and more. He's a dedicated son, brother, employee, and now the husband of my daughter. A new day breaks, a flash of light, dries up the rain before the embers go. Dear Dan, we have evolved together through many changes in our lives, but today marks the best change of all. Today, I will stop calling you my fiance, but my husband instead. It still tingles a little to say that. Thank you for always stepping up to the plate to play ball with me. Time to swing, batter batter. I can't wait to be your wife. All my love, Jody. Jody, as we stand before our closest friends and family, I can't help but reflect how we got here. We never did things the traditional way. At the end of every road, every opinion, and every feeling, we find each other. Us has, and always, will be something worth fighting for. Our stubborn love. Love, Dan. I promise to try to be on time. <laughs> try. <laughs> but most of all, I promise to be a true and loyal friend to you. These are my sacred vows to you, my equal in all things. I love you. In our life together, I will laugh with you, I will cry with you, I will listen to you and console you. I will challenge you but support you. I will accept you and appreciate you. I will protect you and be loyal to you. I will put you and our family first. I will always take time to play catch. And most importantly, above all, I will love you. So these rings upon each other as symbols of hope and love. May they serve as a constant reminder of the vows you have made here today. And now, 
It is my extreme privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. Dan, you may kiss your bride. Ha, 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 ha.